Did you know it's been already four months since the day we met? Four months? Wow. I didn't even realize. <laughs> Rachel, I want you to close your eyes, please. Open them. They're so beautiful. You shouldn't have. I care a lot about you. Thank you. I'm sorry that I'm waiting late. Hmm. What happened? Well, work ran late and they just needed me longer and I'm really sorry. Yeah, we missed our movie. I know. So I wanted to make it up to you and say we can do something else fun. Here. Yes. We're gonna have to watch it here. Okay. <laughs> Alright, but okay. So who cares anyway? What's oh, your name? Okay. Rachel. Rachel, you work down the street? My office is two buildings down. I'm actually having a mixer tonight. You're singles and clearly you're gorgeous and have a great presence. Why don't you come through? Sounds really fun. Let's um, go. I, I, uh, okay. Well, you're going to have a great time. Meet a lot of people. Maybe you make some money with me. <laughs> Okay. Let's do this. Let's do it. I'll just go. Let's okay. Alright, great. Yeah, so I've been in business for about 10 years. Wildly successful. I drive a Ferrari. And I drive a Jeep. This is fucking amazing. Because those, those, I don't get that. Hey, Rachel. Hey, Rachel. Wow, it's the night. Did you have a good time with Mark? You know, actually, I didn't go with Mark. Why didn't you go out with Mark? I thought he asked you. Well, I went with this guy I met at work. I met him. He, he worked right down the street from my work, and he invited me to this cool party. So I went, and it was really fun. You know... Um, I think Mark really likes you. I mean, he really loves you. I think he might be the one. Really? I can tell the way he looks at you. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, he really treats you well. Yeah, that's true. Think of all the things he does. Remember that time you were sick and he came over? He brought, all, brought medicine. I mean, he was there. He was with you. Yeah. He washed your car. Beautiful job washing your car. Yeah, he's, that's true. He shows <laughs> that he loves you. You make great grandbabies. <laughs> You're gonna be a great mom, great wife. You have a beautiful family. That means a lot to hear from you, mom. Thank you so much. I really needed to hear that, actually. I hope that I convinced you. <laughs> All right, well, I'll see you in the morning, okay? Well, uh... Okay. I love you. Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams. <laughs> okay. Good night.
Wow. Dude, middle of the mouth. Oh. Who is that? It's nobody. It's nobody. No. So the party was good last night. What are you talking about? I just saw the text. No, that's nothing. That was nothing. No, it was nothing. It is something to me. Who is that? Who is that? It's it's not anything at all. Come on. Listen. No, I'm, I'm not stupid. I saw the text. I mean. This really isn't a big deal. Why are you asking? This is none of what? your business. It's my personal life. It's none of my business. It shouldn't be. It doesn't you know, matter. I'm, I'm doing my best here with you and you, you're seeing that's no one? You're dating me. Who are you dating? Are you dating somebody else? No, I'm not dating anyone else. It was just a group and you thing. You keep lying to me. No, it's just a group and you're thing. I'm not and you're laughing. laughing about it. I'm laughing. What the heck? Why aren't you, you know what? believing me? It's just a group thing. This is not nothing. It's no big deal. So listen, listen, listen to me. It's not a big deal. I it's mean, it's not a big deal. Yeah. Yeah. How was the party? How was the party? You know what? I mean, it's okay. It's it's not anything. It's just a group thing I went to yesterday. It's not a big deal. So I don't know why you're asking about it. You're cheating on me. No. You're I'm dating not... me, and you're dating other people too. That's what it is. I mean, this is not the first time this happens. I've been trying my best to love you since we met, and you don't seem to care. Yeah. You're right. I should go. I should go. Hey, Julia? Yeah, I just need to, I need to talk. You wanna meet me at our spot? Okay. Why am I like this? <laughs> What's wrong with me? <laughs> So tell me, what's going on? Mark and I broke up. What? Why? He's so in love with you. Mark's not the one to blame. I think I am. I mean, I still love him, but I just, I think I'm scared. Wow, it's really that bad? It's that bad. Wow. Well, I do know someone who can help heal your past and help you not be so afraid. Really? Who? Jesus. Do you remember when Dad left us? I prayed to him every single day, and he came to my rescue when I needed him the most. You didn't listen to me then, but he's been the only one who's never left me. You'll have to trust him 100% and really welcome him into your life. Okay. I think you're right. It's time. Do you want to pray with me? Yeah. Wow, those earrings are so pretty, and they look great. Where did you get them? Mark gave them to me. Why don't you call him? You're so right, okay. <gasps> I did call Mark, and he was willing to start over. We spent time together, building trust with each other, being transparent, and loving each other so much. When my dad left as a child, it was devastating and it taught me a lie, that I was unlovable. What this showed up as in my life as I grew up is an insatiable need for attention and love from guys. I used guys to help me feel better. How could I give that up and only be with Mark? But when I met Jesus, he healed the pain of my dad leaving with his love. I realized my dad left because of his own problems. 
and not me, which showed me another truth, that I am lovable. God gave me the courage to be real. I was so full of God's love, so the desperate need for love and attention was gone. All the shame, all the fear, all the guilt left. God taught me how to love Mark the way he should be loved, just how Jesus loves me. I never knew what love was until I found Jesus. I'm so happy we're back together. Me too. I'm the happiest man in the world. Aw, that's so sweet. I just want you to close your eyes for a second, please. Because you mean so much to me. Will you marry me? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha